Greetings to the members of the Whole World Missionary Baptist Church. I pray that this message finds you in good health and strength and that you are prospering even as your soul does prosper. Just a couple of quick things I want to remind you that tonight we will have our closeout of our Women's Month Bible Studies with your very own First Lady, Lady Sophia Davidson, leading the women. Of course, the men will be over in the library dealing with some issue of relevance to us as well. Then we also want to have you to pay special attention to the e-news each week for you're going to start seeing some highlights of new members that God is blessing us uh, to welcome into the whole well family. We have been tremendously blessed for the past few months with people coming from all walks of life to join in the ministry. So we certainly want to welcome them and highlight them in their coming. They all come with gifts and anointing and a son. We pray that God would bless him to go for it into all that will bring him glory. Then also, I want to just share with you on this Sunday morning, I'm going to be blessed with a special guest uh, that will be bringing the word to us. He's a retired pastor, uh, been all over the place, uh, a native of the Bahamas. Pastor Dr. Wendell McMillan will be with us on Sunday, and he is my next door neighbor. So I'm looking forward to what God is going to say to the church through him. So please continue to invite people to come and to share with us. And as I said on Sunday, uh, there are many characteristics of the Laodicean state that are indeed alive and well in our life of our church. But we know that God gave the word, and he will give other words that will help us to be recovered and heal from those things. And I say to those of you who are there, the word is as it is. There's no changing it. There's no uh, reducing and watering it down. It just is what it is. I stand on it when it is the word of God. And I believe what God has spoken and what God has shared. It convicts me as well as those that we preach it to. So I pray that you will receive it as such and that God will bless our church as we go forward. May God bless you. Look forward to seeing you and hearing from you all again soon.